from the sea monster found in New Zealand to the Montauk monster lying fallow on the beach in Montauk, the world is full of unsettling surprises. Today, we're diving into one of the strangest discoveries yet, terrifying creatures that washed ashore after a massive storm. What's even more shocking, their DNA doesn't match anything known on Earth. Stick around as we explore. 1. Bizarre blue sea creatures are washing up on California beaches. I picked it up anyway, stupidly, because <laughs> now I'm told that I could have gotten stung, but I didn't. What happens when thousands of tiny sea creatures decide to throw a beach party? Well, that's exactly what's going on at Rodeo Beach in Marin. The guests of honor, the Valella Valella, or by the wind sailors, are small, intriguing critters with a bluish tint and a knack for sailing the ocean currents with their petite sails. Melissa Skoest, from the Aquarium of the Bay in San Francisco, points out that while it's not rare to see these jellyfish relatives, the sheer number of them making a shoreline appearance is pretty unusual. Onlooker Natasha Kimmel even called it a natural work of art. Talk about a scenic view. Why the sudden influx? Experts are linking it to this year's wet winter and broader changes in climate. A mix of human-induced climate changes and El Nino patterns might be boosting their numbers. Like and subscribe right now and you'll have amazing luck for the rest of the week. 2. Mystery Loch Ness Monster washes up on a beach in Georgia. Creature washes up on a South Georgia beach and it has everyone scratching their heads. Is it a shark? Is it some kind of sea monster? When you stumble upon something that looks like it swam straight out of a prehistoric era, it's bound to turn heads and start some gossip. That's exactly what happened when Jeff Warren found what appeared to be the Loch Ness Monster's cousin on a beach in Georgia. Spotted at the Wolf Island National Wildlife Refuge, the creature, a half-dead seal look-alike, half-sea monster myth, measured a solid 1.5 meters, 5 feet. Jeff, initially mistaking it for a seal, did a double-take at its long neck and fins, promptly dubbing it a Loch Ness-type thing. The discovery quickly hit the local news circuits, and footage of this mysterious beast made waves. He even reached out to the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service seeking some answers. But even experts were left scratching their heads. 3. The New Zealand Sea Monster Think you've seen it all when a strange, massive beast washes up on your local beach? Well, you're not alone. Back in New Zealand, a bizarre spectacle turned heads when a monstrous 30-foot carcass sporting large teeth and flippers landed on the Bay of Plenty Beach. Caught on camera by a group buzzing around on four-wheelers, this creepy find quickly whipped up tales of sea monsters and prehistoric dinosaurs. The video hit YouTube, rallying internet sleuths far and wide to crack the case. But before things could dive too deep into the realm of the fantastic, a marine biologist stepped in with a reality check. It turned out this so-called sea monster was just an orca, its identity confirmed by the unique shape of its flippers. This isn't the first time oceanic oddities have captured our imagination. Over the years, blobsters, or blobs as they're affectionately known, have made appearances from Newfoundland to Florida. These decomposing sea creatures often stir up rumors of mythical beasts lurking beneath the waves. 4. Montauk Monster Found on Beach it's like a bang and punch Yeah, the, it does look like human yeah, teeth. Yeah, but still, gold teeth in the back, they ain't, they ain't like humans. Sometimes, the stuff of nightmares washes up on the beach, and in July 2008, that's exactly what happened in Montauk, New York. The internet couldn't stop buzzing about a photo showing a bizarre carcass that looked eerily like the demon from Ghostbusters. Dubbed the Montauk Monster, this creature sparked wild speculations and a media frenzy, mainly because no one could figure out just what it was. 
The plot thickened when the remains mysteriously disappeared, spirited away by unknown individuals before scientists could get a proper look. However, experts who peeked at the viral photo guessed it was a raccoon, albeit one that had seen better days, having lost its hair and skin to decomposition, making it look far from its cute dumpster diving self. Five. Alien-like sea creature washes ashore on Malaysian beach. Imagine you're enjoying a sunny day at Telok Milano Beach in Malaysia when something bizarre catches your eye. A massive, mysterious lump of flesh has washed ashore, instantly becoming the talk of the town. Dubbed a globster, this roughly six-foot-long heap of decaying matter sparked a mix of horror and curiosity among the locals when it appeared last Friday around noon. Now, a globster isn't your everyday beach find. These unidentified organic masses often turn out to be remnants of marine giants like whales, sharks, or even octopuses. But without a DNA test, their true identity remains a puzzle. The discovery was made by the APM Coastal Rescue Team during their routine patrol, and soon after, images and videos started circulating on social media. Crowds gathered, peering at the strange spectacle, with reactions ranging from sympathy for the deceased creature to outright creepiness. Back in 2018, a similar eerie, hairy globster appeared in the Philippines, measuring a staggering 20 feet in length and reeking to high heaven. While some thought of it as a strange omen, researchers were quick to collect samples for identification, keeping everyone on their toes about the sea's mysterious ways. Six, a deep sea fish with a light bulb on its head mysteriously washes ashore in California. Last uh, Friday morning, uh, the lifeguards got a report that a weird fish was rolling around in the surf at Swami's up in Encinitas. They collected the fish and let some folks know and it ended up here in the collection, so. Catching something like a deep sea anglerfish on camera is rare enough, but imagine stumbling across one while walking on a California beach. That's exactly what happened to Ben Estes, who found this eerie creature at Crystal Cove State Park in Orange County. Normally, these critters swim about 3,000 feet below the surface, so spotting one on the sand is a real head-scratcher. This particular fish, likely a Pacific football fish, boasts some terrifying features like sharp teeth and a glowing bulb on its head to lure unsuspecting prey in the pitch-black depths. Usually, these anglerfish don't venture anywhere near beach towels and sunscreen. Female football fish can grow up to two feet long, dwarfing the tiny males, which only reach about an inch and spend their lives attached to their mates in a bizarre reproductive twist. Adding to its oddity, you might recognize the anglerfish from its cameo in the movie Finding Nemo. While experts and beachgoers were left baffled by its unexpected appearance ashore, it certainly made for an unforgettable beach day mystery. Seven, man captures weird blob creature on rocks. There's hardly a dull moment on the internet, but some things just take the cake, or in this case, the creep factor to a whole new level. Remember that spine tingling symbiote from the movie Venom? Well, something eerily similar popped up in a video from St. Lucia and it's as bizarre as it sounds. Captured wriggling on a rock, this slimy black creature, looking like a blob of cooling tar, took social media by storm. The footage, lacking any real detail about what this thing might be or where exactly it was found, still managed to rack up millions of views. People were hooked, and who could blame them? In the video, you can see someone off camera poking at this mysterious mass with a large knife, trying to uncover its secrets. The internet did what it does best, throwing around guesses 
some suggesting it was a mass of worms, far less grim than a parasitic alien ready to hijack human bodies, right? 8. Locals puzzled after massive sea creature washes up on beach. What happens when a mysterious sea creature ends up on a beach, turning the sand into a scene from a sci-fi movie? This was the case when a colossal 50-foot carcass washed up on the shores of Indonesia, initially mistaken for a beached boat by local fisherman Asrul Tuanakota. At first glance, with its tentacle-like structures, many thought they had stumbled upon a giant squid. However, this sea saga took a twist. The decomposing leviathan painted the nearby waters red, not from the plot of a horror movie, but simply the blood seeping from its body, attracting locals who swarmed the beach to snap photos. Expert input from George Leonard of the Ocean Conservancy steered the mystery toward a more familiar marine giant, a baleen whale. The carcass had bloated to its massive size due to gases produced by decomposition, and the presence of skeleton parts and baleen plates backed up this theory. Located along a whale migration route, Siram Island seemed a plausible checkpoint for this unfortunate creature's journey. While dead whales usually sink to nourish deep sea dwellers, this one, possibly due to an infection or unnatural cause, floated ashore instead. This bizarre event adds to the roster of unusual sea carcass discoveries documented in our smartphone era, echoing similar occurrences in Australia and the Philippines. 9. Bizarre Sea Creature Found on Mexico Beach This scenario unfolded in Acapulco, Mexico, where beachgoers stumbled upon the colossal remains of what looked like a scene from a mythical ocean tale. Speculation buzzed, was it a giant squid, a beached whale, or something out of folklore? Sabas de la Rosa Camacho from Protección Civil y Bomberos was on the scene, reporting that the remains stretched an impressive 14 meters. Despite its decomposed state, the mystery mass didn't give off the stench you'd expect, probably because it had been floating around at sea for quite some time before the weather nudged it ashore. A curious clip circulating shows a man investigating the mysterious mass, adding to the intrigue. Marine biologists took their time to dig a little deeper and finally declared it to be part of a sperm whale's head. James Mead from the National Museum of Natural History shed some light on the matter, explaining it was likely the top half of the head, including the junk, that's connective tissue that had separated from the skull. 10. Mysterious water monsters appear on Thai beaches. In the picturesque setting of Koh Lanta, a stunning island off Thailand's southwestern coast, beachgoers stumbled upon an odd sight that could stump even the seasoned marine biologists among us. We're talking about a tiny, transparent creature, about the size of your average smartphone, scooting along the sandy shores. It's not every day you see something that looks like a living drop of water. The curious tourist tried to help it back into the ocean, only to watch it make a beeline for the beach again. The local crowd and visitors are scratching their heads over this one. Could it be a sea cucumber that's lost its way? Doubtful, since it doesn't seem to move much on its own. There's chatter about it being anything from a leech to a sea slug. Some are even half-joking that it might be an extraterrestrial. Hey, stranger things have happened, right? While the experts haven't pinned down exactly what these gelatinous guests are, they've become the talk of the town. Harmless and oddly endearing, they've sparked a wave of curiosity and chuckles rather than concern. 11. Jellyfish in Fest Beach It's a veritable jellyfish haven on the beaches of Crimea. Imagine you're all set for a sun-soaked day at the beach in Crimea, especially near the quaint village of Shulkin, 
but instead of clear blue waters, you're greeted by a sea of jellyfish. These shores, once a hot spot for tourists escaping the summer heat, are now swarming with these gelatinous intruders. Blame it on the consistently warmer temperatures. Thank you, climate change, which not only cranks up the heat, but also makes the sea saltier by reducing the flow of fresh river water. It's the perfect jellyfish paradise. And while these creatures in the Azov Sea won't send you to the hospital, they're no one's idea of a good time. They sting and touching them. As one tourist from Moscow put it, it's like a cold, sticky, and downright yucky experience. With jellyfish taking over, the once bustling beaches are now eerily quiet as beachgoers steer clear of the unwelcome squishy party crashes. 12. Fat Innkeeper Worm. We're with a group of sixth graders that uh, are having lunch right now. Stumbling across thousands of squishy pink 10-inch blobs on a California beach might sound like the setup for a sci-fi movie, but hold your horses, it's just nature being weirdly wonderful. These aren't any old sea creatures. They're the famous penis fish, or more accurately, Urechis calpo, the fat innkeeper worm. Found from southern Oregon all the way down to Baja, California, Mexico, these worms are quite the local celebrities on the Pacific coast. Now, despite the risque nickname, these guys are neither actual fish nor parts of the male anatomy. They're marine worms that spend their days crafting U-shaped burrows in the sand. These burrows aren't just homes, but also their dining rooms. From one end, they excrete a sticky mucus net to snag plankton and bits of food, sucking it back to filter out goodies before jetting the rejects out the other end. Their architectural skills also benefit other sea critters like crabs and shrimp, earning them the innkeeper moniker. But why the beach party with thousands of them? It's likely thanks to stormy weather, possibly stirred up by El Nino, that disrupted their sandy hideaways, leaving them exposed. 13. Fanged predatory lancet fish on the Washington coast. At Jeanette's Pier in Nags Head, North Carolina, beachgoers were in for quite the spectacle when a lancet fish, a creature straight out of a deep sea horror story, made a rare appearance on the shore. This isn't your average fish, with its formidable fangs and an impressive dorsal fin that towers over its body, the lancet fish looks like it swam out of a nightmare. Not just a nighttime terror, lancet fish have some pretty quirky traits. These creatures are hermaphrodites during their youth and boast a scaleless, porous skin. They can stretch up to a whopping 6.5 feet and prefer dining under the cover of darkness, snacking on anything from their own kind to squid and smaller fish. 14. Largest recorded small tooth sawfish washes up dead in Florida. Who says scientific discoveries can't come with a bit of drama? Take, for instance, a mammoth 16 foot long sawfish, an impressive female discovered in the Florida Keys. And she wasn't just any sawfish, she was the largest ever recorded by experts. Even more remarkable, she was carrying eggs the size of softballs. Sadly, she wasn't found cruising the ocean depths, but rather had already passed away. But here's where the intrigue kicks up a notch. Researchers, including fish biologist Greg Poulakis from the Florida Fish and Wildlife Commission, are all over this. They're diving deep into her life story, figuring out her age and her reproductive tales. This isn't just a one-off curiosity either. Just a week earlier, two other sawfish met a similar fate in the Keys. Coincidence? Maybe. But scientifically valuable? Absolutely. These creatures have been on the endangered list since 2003, and every bit of data is gold. From examining their vertebrae to estimate ages, the oldest so far clocked in at 14, 
to studying their DNA for family ties. It's a mix of CSI and marine biology. And though the cause of their demise remains a mystery, the facts gathered will fuel conservation efforts, aiming to give these oceanic wonders a fighting chance at survival. 15. Mysterious Sea Creature Extraordinary Caught on Camera What initially seemed like a massive oil spill in San Diego Bay actually turned out to be a colossal school of anchovies. This wasn't just a small cluster of fish. The spectacle stretched an impressive 100 meters long and 15 meters wide. Bathers and scientists alike were treated to a rare and mysterious sight as nearly a million silver-colored anchovies shimmered in the water. The unexpected visit from these fish, which generally prefer the chillier waters, was a head-scratcher since the bay's warm 23rds temperature isn't their usual hangout. Adding to the puzzle, the usual buffet of zooplankton they munch on was scarce, nixing the food theory for their beachside gathering. The phenomenon didn't just catch the eye of beachgoers. Marine biologists from the Scripps Institution of Oceanography were on hand, diving in for a closer look. David Checkley, one of the researchers, couldn't hide his enthusiasm, calling it a once in 30 years event. Even local seals and sharks didn't miss the chance to dive into this unexpected feast. By evening, the anchovy army had moved on, heading north. While such gatherings are rare, there was a similar event earlier in Marina del Rey, though that one ended less spectacularly for the fish, trapped and suffocated due to low oxygen. 16. Strange, unidentified sea creature filmed at drilling site. Back in 2007, an oil company's remotely operated vehicle, exploring a mile and a half beneath the Gulf of Mexico, filmed the elusive Magna Pina squid. Known for its bizarre, long arms that bend like elbows, this rare creature appeared near an oil development site for the first time ever. The footage revealed much about the squid's striking features, from its arm length, which can span between 5 to 23 feet, to its unique feeding method that involves skimming its tentacles along the sea floor. These captivating visuals not only intrigued researchers, but also highlighted the unexpected benefits of combining technological pursuits with scientific discovery. As oil companies venture further into the abyss, their advanced equipment brings more of these hidden wonders into the spotlight. Through initiatives like the Serpent Project, partnerships between scientists and the oil industry are flourishing, providing invaluable glimpses into the deep sea's mysterious inhabitants. 17. Beached Fish Sparks Earthquake Talk Just days apart, Two enormous oarfish washed ashore, stirring up more than just sand. The first, a stunning 14-foot specimen, turned heads, but it was the 18-foot giant found on Santa Catalina Island that really got people talking. Social media lit up with chatter, linking these rare sightings to an ancient Japanese myth about oarfish predicting earthquakes. But scientists are quick to brush off any spooky seismic connections. Over at the Scripps Institution of Oceanography, the buzz turned to curiosity as experts dove into studying these elusive sea creatures. The larger fish, despite its size, was found in great health, plump and disease-free. It looks good enough to eat if you have a 13F pan, quipped biologist Ruff Zetter, lightening the mood. They're even running tests for radiation to rule out any effects from the Fukushima incident. These finds are a golden ticket for marine biologists. Oarfish, mysterious beasts of the deep, can grow up to a whopping 50 feet, diving as deep as 3,280 feet. They float through the ocean vertically and snack on protein, showing up in waters from the tropics to the temperate zones. It's rare to see one, let alone study it up close making these beachside discoveries a real treat for science. 18. 
massive unidentified sea monster caught on video off oil rig. Catching something odd on camera is one thing, but when that oddity turns out to be a mysterious sea creature lurking deep in the Gulf of Mexico, you know you've got a story on your hands. This all unfolded two years ago, but the peculiar browny orange blob that floated into view at a depth of 5,000 feet near an oil rig only recently got its name badge. The experts at the Monterey Bay Aquarium Research Center cracked the case. Those few visible markings, including what turned out to be its gonads, were key clues. The verdict? It was a placental jellyfish. This rare species can balloon up to two feet in diameter, although it's usually hanging out in the chillier Antarctic waters, not the Gulf of Mexico. 19. Gigantic sunfish that washed up on Oregon Beach could be the largest of its species ever found. Here's a beach surprise you don't see every day. A massive, seven-foot-long fish making a rare appearance on the Oregon coast. The curious creature, identified as a hoodwinker sunfish, Molotecta, is one of the heftiest bony fish, and it's not often spotted in the Northern Hemisphere. This unexpected guest was discovered in Gearhart, Oregon, by beachgoers who couldn't believe their eyes. Measuring a whopping 7.3 feet, this sunfish might just set a record, as noted in the Seaside Aquarium's Facebook update. Marine biologist Marianne Niegaard, who played a role in identifying this species, confirmed its identity after scrutinizing photos and measurements sent her way. Known scientifically as Mola Tecta, the hoodwinker is a member of the Mola genus, which also includes the ocean sunfish, Mola Mola, and the bumphead sunfish, Mola Alexandrini. These giants can stretch up to 11 feet and weigh as much as 2.3 tons. What sets the hoodwinkers apart is their sleek, smooth bodies without the typical ridges. 20. Dead humpback whale washes up on Jersey Shore Beach. Waking up to a humpback whale washed up on your local beach isn't your typical morning view. But that's exactly what happened at L Street Beach in Seaside Park, New Jersey. Early risers and police officers found themselves staring at a massive whale carcass at around 4.30 a.m. this Wednesday. The scene attracted not just local onlookers, but also biologists from the Marine Mammal Stranding Center, who hurried to examine this unexpected visitor. Sergeant Andrew Casole noted that the whale seemed to have been adrift for a while before the tide brought it ashore. Throughout that Wednesday, the whale played a bit of hide-and-seek, drifting away into the ocean by evening, only to reappear overnight. The diligent officers patrolling the beach spotted it again, still bobbing in the surf. Curiously, this might be the same whale spotted earlier in a busy shipping channel. And if you're counting, that's one of at least 11 whales that have made their unexpected landfall in the New York and New Jersey area. That's all for today's video, folks. What do you think? Which of these mysterious creatures surprised you the most? Have you ever witnessed something unexplainable after a storm? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more mind-blowing discoveries in the future.